when you connect with a client as well, that's so powerful. And sometimes you can almost see a little shift just from a conversation that you've had. You can see a shift in the way that they're thinking or in their mental state. And then over a period of a few weeks, maybe you get to see them start to improve. And that's so powerful for both of you, that connection that you develop. It's really amazing. It's fulfilling and it's something that I have that I'm looking after a person and caring after an individual who is vulnerable, who are distressed, and I'm there. I'm taking the job. So every single shift I come in, I show up, I feel happy. It can be an area that perhaps you hadn't considered, because to be quite honest, at the beginning of my nursing degree, I hadn't even really thought of going down the mental health path. But it's sort of the more I learnt and the more I understood, the more it became more appropriate for me. So just do it. Oh, I just love my job. I just really love my job. Um, you know, I, if it's going out and seeing a patient in the community or still managing a, a large team of, of 100 staff, I just love my job. I, at, the, at the very core of everything, I am a nurse and that's what I will continue to do and that is service delivery for our patients. Yeah, I feel like everyone deserves to have someone to listen to them and I feel like I felt like I could be there for them and they're so vulnerable and you get to be that first person that they want to talk to and you get to hear so many interesting stories and backgrounds and I was just like, wow, this is amazing. Like, I wouldn't want to be anywhere else. I get to help people in ways I never thought was even possible. I think if you are considering a career in mental health, it's a really good idea to just go for it. Just do it. Uh, whether you are trying to get into it through a qualification or because you have lived experience, there are so many pathways and it's such an important sector to be involved in now. It's just growing and changing and improving all the time. I think with the patient cohort, they know you're there to help, even when there are difficult days and they're quite unwell. Seeing them come out on the other side once they've completed their treatment and are ready for discharge, it's been re really, really rewarding. We are among the nurses who look after uh, an acutely unwell person. So that person may be not happy, that person may be crying or really sad, and we are there to listen. Being the person to help people in their most vulnerable state, when they're really unwell, when things are really hard for them, following that journey, following them through to recovery and being that person to assist them in that.